Well, my name is Jessica McGlory, and my teacher is Amy Kokenderfer, or Amy Price now, and uh, she, she taught at uh, she taught me at Notre Dame Preparatory High School in Pontiac, Michigan. Miss Kokenderfer was a significant teacher in my life simply because of her kindness and her care. I can honestly say that uh, I don't remember every lesson plan we ever did and I, I don't know all of the apostles still. I, there are things that I've forgotten but I do know that I can love myself and be true to myself and that's okay and a big part of that is because of her openness and her willingness to tell me that I am who I am and that is something that is worth uh, loving and appreciating. An experience that I had was just in class, it was always so open. Students could really feel comfortable with saying how they felt and really just um, express all of the different frustrations of a typical day of school. So that relationship was already formed between me and my other classmates that we had with her. So that was what spurred me being able to feel comfortable enough to go up to her and talk to her about my impending decision to go to uh, ex-gay camp and uh, try to get reparative therapy. And um, it was that experience where she simply looked at me like I had really just lost my way. She really looked confused as to how I could see myself as anything other than a perfect person because I am myself and being true to myself was what I needed. The culture around her classroom was one of the few classrooms where um, you could feel completely okay being yourself. It was one of the few where you didn't have to worry about um, other students who wanted to say bad things about you because you knew that wouldn't fly in her class. That wouldn't fly in Ms. Kokender's first class. This is the one place you can let loose, really have a good time, and um, obviously still learn, but it was in a way that you wanted to learn. It was in a way that made it fun to learn. And that was just incredible. Students would literally, before school would even start, hang out in her classroom and hang out with her and talk with her and feel okay before having to rush off to get to their first period class. And I just think that it's because of how she just structured everything. She made it so anyone who came in there would feel like they had a rightful seat in that classroom. The kind of person that Ms. Kopenerfer has inspired me to be is one that is able to be open and honest. I think that for a long time I felt that I had to lie. And you're taught very young not to lie, to be truthful. But then at a certain age, when people don't like your truth, they tell you once again to lie, to keep it hidden. And I now know that I can be a person who is open, who is honest, and who is brave. Because being honest about who you are is one of the bravest things you have to do, especially when it's not in the mold of what people want. And uh, I feel like that's how you can be one of the best people. And I think that that is what she has taught me to aspire to. I realize that you probably never knew the impact that you had on me, but it was more great than you will ever know. So thank you.